busy all morning long battling and investigating a massive blaze at a popular restaurant near NC State University. Good morning and thanks for watching WNCN News at 11. Glad that you're with us. I'm Mike Gonzalez. Good morning. I'm Stephan Chase. Raleigh firefighters were busy investigating what sparked a huge fire at the Sushi 9 restaurant on Western Boulevard near Gorman Street. Authorities battled that blaze for hours this morning. WNCN's Emma Wright joins us live from the scene with the very latest. Emma? Well, this is just a huge fire, and we're going to give you a look at what it looks like right now. There is not much left. The inside completely burned out. Everything is just charred, just reduced to ashes. Basically, the fire department, they've been on scene all morning. If you look over here, they're actually still out here. We've seen them go up onto the roof a few times and spray some water to put out some hot spots that we've seen pop up over the course of the morning. We're going to show you some video of what this looked like earlier. We know this fire broke out around 430 this morning. It took them till about 6.30 to put it out. I did speak with the owner of Sushi 9 earlier today. She says this is obviously very upsetting. She was too upset to talk on camera, but she says she does plan on rebuilding. I talked with some employees. They say about 25 to 30 people worked here. They say now they are without a job, and it's quite stressful. It is stressful. I know some people use this job to feed their families. I know it's really stressful. It's a tragedy, but... Life goes on. We have to keep moving. Like, we can't just sit and look at it and just cry about it. The cause of this fire is still under investigation. The Raleigh Fire Department says the good news here is that no one was injured in the fire. WNCN will continue to follow this story. We will bring you updates on WNCN.com and on the news at 6 and 7. Reporting live in Raleigh, I'm Emma Wright, WNCN.